Defensive tackle Deron Payne came on our radar probably around his sophomore year uh, when we started to see some of his sophomore highlights. And, and then after that, we got to see him at the Under Armour Combine and, and then at numerous camp stops, ended up at our five-star challenge and then in the Under Armour All-America game. So again, that arc of progression. Um, and I remember heading into the five-star challenge, he was a five-star guy um, and a kid who was very inconsistent when it came to camps but on film he was outstanding so again it's it's a it's a blend of of body of work for us when it comes to ranking prospects if they're not great in camps but they are tremendous on film or if they're inconsistent in camps and and great on film uh that's that's a big part of this and and that's kind of what i remember about Payne. he would beat you with a rip move or a power move inside and look great on one rep. And then the next rep, he'd get stoned and, and play a little too high, and, and he was very raw and inconsistent. And you just wonder when he's gonna put it all together. However, the way he was built and the power that he had and when he did play with leverage was just too much to ignore. So we made him a five-star prospect. We kept him as a five-star prospect, mainly based on his ability, again, to push the pocket, to be a guy who could play a zero technique at the next level or a three technique and we figured he would get more consistent with his pass rushing moves and that leverage uh, and, and playing too high. And, and all of that's come true. I mean, he's been outstanding at Alabama. Now he's on the radar as a potential first rounder in the NFL draft. And, um, you know, that, that interesting progression arc with, with the Ron Payne, uh, where we saw him in pads and he was great. We saw him in camps, he was okay. Uh, other camps, he was very inconsistent and then you know, up and down. But in the All-America game, I thought he was excellent throughout the week. <clears throat> He's an interesting one to follow. And a guy that in other situations, we could have just said, oh, well, you know what? We're not seeing the consistency here. Let's drop him down to a four. We held firm and I'm glad we did.